What up, what up, y'all? Tim Z here. Back at it again, like you can always expect. You know what I mean? And today, just a quick video on why the Spider Co. Manix sucks. Alright, guys. First of all, this one's Maximate. Real chippy steel. And they crack. Alright? That's number one. Secondly, it's a chunky-ass knife. Alright? Look. It's real chunky, okay? We're gonna compare it right now to the Benchmade 940, all right? Similar style lock, right? This one's kind of like a Benchmade Anthem a little bit, right? But the action is very stiff. And I know some of y'all gonna be like, this is rugged and stuff, but not really, all right? Not really. This thing will break just like any other folder. Okay. The spring on this is uh, pretty stiff, so if you get used to this, the Benchmade is going to feel like butter, seriously, right? It's going to feel like butter, like the, it's super light, access lock, different kind of lock, but still. I know. Some of y'all are going to say this is for hard use. Is it really, though? Especially this lightweight model. Right, right with these scales. Probably not. So, I know not everyone likes to fidget with knives. This one clearly wins in fidgeting. It, it wins in uh, carry, also slim profile. Smooth. Just feels better. Overall, better warranty from Benchmade. Spider Co. is doesn't replace blades. All right, so that makes it to me not a hard user. Also, all right. And there's not much else to say about this. Actually, just not a fan of the Manix Two. Are you a fan? All right. Yeah, I'm not. This is going to be sold. And this one has been around in the collection for a long, long time. It's not going to leave. All right. It's a 940. Classic. All right, guys. I want to keep this under three minutes for the first time in my career. All right, guys. This is Tim Z. If you want to follow, uh, see more, subscribe. Follow me on Instagram, Tim Z USA. And until next time, Tim Z out.